Let's head up to Scotland with SNP spokesperson with the first of his two questions, Pete Wishart. Pete Wishart. Thank you very much, Mr Speaker. It's, it's now some 50 days until we go over the Brexit cliff edge. And in the meantime, the COVID death rate in the UK reaches 50,000. England's in the middle of another national lockdown. Unemployment is on the rise. And the faceless characters that actually run this country, number 10, are at each other's throats. Should Scotland be celebrating this incoming Brexit? And whose side is he on, Dons or Carries? Minister. Well, I'm, I'm on the side of people from uh, uh, Aberdeen to Aberystwyth who voted to leave the UB, European Union, uh, who want us as a United Kingdom to make a success of these new opportunities. Um, I know that the Scottish Government is a total stranger to behind-the-scenes intrigue um, and briefing wars. <laughs> Uh, uh, so uh, I can imagine his uh, shock and amazement to see these things reported in the newspapers, but let me assure him uh, that the Government continues to make decisions in the interests of the whole United Kingdom, and the people of uh, Perth and North Perthshire can have confidence, not just that they have uh, a, a gamesome representative in this House of Commons, but also a Government committed to their welfare. <laughs> 